Hey guys, in this episode we'll be playing in The Medium. Uh, it's a brand new game. It got released uh, a couple of days ago. Uh, on the Steam page it describes this game as a third-person psychological horror game. Um, it's um, It kind of looks a little bit like Silent Hill, to be honest. We're gonna go ahead and get into the game. Uh, I'm just gonna go check out the settings before we start. Alright, so settings are done. Let's go ahead and hit new game. Play button. I guess I press any button to play? Yeah. It Here all we go. starts with a dead girl. Okay. Ever since I was little, I've had this dream. It's the end of summer. The girl is running through the woods. The moon, the scent of pines. And then the gunshot. It always felt so real. The blood on my cheek, the cold sweat running down my skin. I'd managed to convince myself it really happened. This scar of a memory. Part of me I could never fully understand. Um, well, that wasn't the only part. No wonder people used to think I was strange. If they only knew. If they only knew what? That day when the phone rang, it was the hardest day of my life. The day I went home to say goodbye to my father, to dress him up for his last journey, put him in a suit, fix his tie. Simple. Just the things he did every day. But looking through his stuff wasn't easy. I needed a moment to pull myself together. I was almost ready. I just had to find his special tie clip. Alright, so we are in the game now. Uh, yeah. There's no mouse control. This game definitely gives me Silent Hill vibes. 
Uh, how do we... Okay, left mouse. What are these? Um, they're pages from a calendar. Funeral. So I guess... Yeah, Memorial of the Holy Garden Angel. Funeral ultrasound. Our Lady of the Rosary. Biopsy. What is this? Lots of funerals and ultrasounds. Okay, go back. I'm looking for a tie clip, I think they said. Kind of wish I could... Yeah, we can probably do that. Check the key bindings so we can see our objectives. I don't think there is anything else to do here. Read. Yeah. No. Maybe we go out the door. We probably do. Yeah. The game looks nice as well. Oh. Shit. Cat. Yeah. Nice to see you too. What is this? Uh, should we give him food? Oh. Wait a minute. Funeral home key. Nah. We don't feed the cat with a funeral home key. What is this? Looks nourishing. <laughs> cat food. Alright, let's feed the cat. Guess we... Here you go. Cat What's food? Your face? Glad to see you're still kicking around. Nice cat. What is this? Symbolic funeral of the Sierra's mine. Oh, miners from the Sierra's mine came to work today as usual, but instead of flashlights and pickaxes, they carried a black casket adorned with lit candles. A symbol of their company's demise. This is not the death of our mine, say members of the Sears of Mine. Rescue committee, we will not let our jobs be bur buried. This casket is meant for the Vistula Coal Company, they added. The miners have also announced that they will come to work tomorrow. They refuse to accept that Sears of Mine was liquidated. Meanwhile, their colleagues continue to protest outside the company headquarters in Taishi building a symbolic wall in the entrance. Each day they add another layer of bricks. There are only five left until the wall reaches the ceiling. Alright, I don't think we need to read all this. Let's go look for that tie clip. Wherever it is. I can't believe it's all still here. Oh, Jack. something over here oh how to develop photos illuminate photo for five seconds dip in multigrade for three seconds dip in stop for three seconds dip in fixer for three seconds all right oh we don't have any photos oh well do i need to are we gonna come back here is there going to be, like, we have a camera that we can snap pictures with and then go back here and, uh, I don't know. Let's go this way. It's over here. Oh. Uh, right. The tie clip. The tie clip. Pull yourself together, Marianne. So I guess our name is Marianne. Marianne? Marianne? I don't know. Interesting. 1984. Why is this interesting? I don't really know. Can we run? No running. Is that another cat? Jack's room. It's like he never... Damn it. Jack was a humble, religious man. He ran a funeral home 
and I'd help out whenever I could. It felt good to be useful. I used to think I'd never fit in. But Jack, he didn't mind my weirdness. He kept telling me I was special. Keep hissing at me. Who do you think's gonna feed you now? Was he mad? The cat is... Jack was part of the solidarity movement. He spent a few months in an internment camp, but even that couldn't dampen his spirit. All right, where is the tie clip? Hey, cat. Why are you hissing at me? I don't know. Did you see something that I missed? Oh, let's go in here. No bedroom. Or Weird to be back in my old room. Oh. So many memories. I don't think we'll find the tie clip in here. Yeah. I used to have a thing for them. Don't but know why, really. I guess they just used to make me happy. Jack knew it well. That's why there's so many of them here. Okay. Butterflies. Kids from the orphanage. Not all of them had my luck. That's why I kept coming back. To play. To take care of them. To listen. That was the least I could do. I used to get a lot of these. To me, they were like trophies. Badges of honor for doing the right thing. Jack wasn't too amused, but he did his best to cover for me. I kind of feel bad for making him go through all that. We must request you attend the next parent-teacher meeting, as we would like to discuss with you the situation that took place last Thursday. To recap... Marianne gave one of the students a message from his recently deceased grandmother. We understand it was Marianne's way of consoling her fellow stu student, but we are sure you realize that this behavior is inappropriate. Inappropriate, to say the least. Given that this is not the first behavioral problem we've informed you about, we believe it's high time for us to meet and talk about Marianne's future in our school. Did we get kicked out? My oldest family heirloom. As a kid, I'd show this to people just to freak them out. I'd usually say something like, Pretty sick, huh? I was such a dork. What is this? Initial diagnosis. Second degree thermal burns. Covering 35% of total... Body. Who is this? This is us. Body surface area. Inhalation? Injury? Alright. Can we go this way? Nope. Where's this tie clip, then, that we need to find? It's not out in the window. I would, I would guess it was in the... Like a bedroom or something. What? How? Wait a minute. Let's go back here. It could be in his room. Jack's room. This was Jack's room. Oh, there's something over here. It's my bit. Come on, Jack. Where'd you put it? Come on, okay. Jack. Let's do this the other way. The other way? Press and hold left control to activate insight. Oh. That's right. We're a medium, aren't we? So... There you are. Say goodbye to Jack. Get to the funeral. 
home. All right. Okay, I think that's it. Jack's waiting downstairs. Wait. But Time Jack to say goodbye. Oh yeah. Let's go. We lived upstairs from Jack's funeral home. It wasn't as weird as it sounds. Besides, if it wasn't for that, I may never have learned to use my powers. Powers, you say? I wish there was a way to run. Run. Jack taught me to accept my condition. Of all my foster parents, he was the only one who saw it as a gift and not a curse. What does this sign say? The last goodbye, funeral home. Let's get in here. Oh, use the key here. There we go. Open up. Let me in. Jack's in the prep room. Prepare Jack for his last journey. Is this the prep room? Prep room. Personnel only. Hold on, let, let me just investigate here first. We might miss something in here. Oh yeah, look at that. There's something on the table. How do we get there? Well, there's a lot of stuff here. Let's use our insight. Here it is. Prep room. Ah, uh -huh. so I was gonna go get the key over here. General information. Date of birth, name of mother. Married. Who is this, by the way? Adam Nowak. I don't know who... Adam... Jack. Mrs. Nowak brought funeral payment from confirmation today. It's in the cabinet. Also, Robert took Friday off, so we'll need to find someone else for the funeral. In the cabinet, you say? How do we get into the cabinet? If there's money, we might want to take it. Just saying. I don't think we can. All right, let's let's leave this room now. For now. Okay, nothing else over here. Let's go into the prep room. Prep room key. Are we supposed to go down? Guess we are. Open up. Okay. I'm not sure if I'm ready for this. I guess nobody ever will be, right? I wouldn't. Like, is this her father? Yeah, hey, there. Jack. Somebody in here. Oh, I'm supposed to pull it out or him. So. Getting used to the keys is going to be... Alright. It's going to take a while, I guess. What? I can't use that over here? 
Why not? I got your special clip. Oh. No. We need a tie? tie. Let's go find... Oh, it's over here. Easy. Combine with... Combine? With that? Okay. Snazzy. You wouldn't have it any other way. I didn't expect this to be easy. I guess I didn't know what to expect. When things get personal, it... It just burns you from the inside out. There. I guess you're ready. But... Am I? Is she going to burn him in here? This is like a morgue. I don't know. Oh, can't you people read? The signs that's closed. <laughs> Going on with the lights. Check upstairs. Okay. It's really dark. Hard oh, what the hell is that? Oh no. Okay, let's go. Maybe I should have used my powers there to see if. I would see something different. I don't know. Is that the cat? I don't think so. Of course we're gonna have to go... What the hell? Check it out. What happened? Oh, okay. What's going on? I was supposed to go this. Guess you felt it too, huh? What? Oh. And then it happened, as it did so many times before. Just when I thought my day couldn't get any worse. Oh. oh, where is that darn notebook? I'm gonna be late. I need to find that. Marianne? Oh, oh. Marianne, are, are you are you crying, my child? Yeah. Yeah. I... It, it's fine, Jack. Yeah. Now, you didn't happen to see my notebook, did you, darling? Uh, my memory's a bit fuzzy. So much for aging gracefully, eh? Where is that thing? Listen, Jack. Hmm? You should probably get some rest. Forget the notebook. Oh, no, no, I've got so much work, my dear. It's I, okay, I, Jack. No, I, I can't just... What? Let it go. Uh, it's not important. You... you are crying. What's wrong, dear? <gasps> oh, why is it so cold in here? <laughs> where is that shh, damn shh, shh, shh. Huh? It's okay, and, Jack. Huh? It's okay. Oh. My sweet little Marianne. What would I 
ever do without you? <laughs> Jack. Mm. Don't worry about it. Uh, it's time to get uh, some rest. Oh, mm. Marianne. Yeah? No. Oh, uh, I, I, uh, I'm worried about the surgery. When I'm at the hospital, are, are you sure you're going to be all right? Yes, Jack. It's going to be fine. Uh, oh, you, you know, I, I promised myself once I, I would never let anything happen to you. Not while I'm around. I'll be fine. I promise. Uh, <laughs> no risky stuff then. Huh? All right? All right, Jack. I need, oh, yes, yes. Be, be good, Marianne. I love you, my child. I've loved you since the moment you walked into my life. Remember that. Always. He walked into the light. Most people would give anything to have that opportunity. To say all the things that were left unsaid. But it didn't make things any easier. I could help a thousand souls cross over, but when it came to Jack, it still hurt like hell. I love you too, Daddy. I used to think everyone saw the world the way I did. Divided. Torn between two realities. But, no. I was the only one. Oh. Or so I thought. We're closed. There's another funeral home across town. I can give you the number. I... Marianne. Who is this? You don't know me, Marianne. But I know you. L look. If this is a joke... I... You need to listen to me, Marianne. Okay, I I'm hanging up. I know what you are. What? Who is this? My name is Thomas. I need your help. Uh -huh. <laughs> listen, if that's all you've got, I'm... No, no, there's more. I can give you the answers you've been looking for your whole life. But I, I need you to trust me. Trust you? I don't even know you. It all starts with a dead girl. What did you say? The Nebo Resort. Find me there. Please. The light, it's almost gone. It's not dark yet, but it's getting there. You're the only one who can stop it. You're my only chance. Hello? Hello? Oh, shit. Okay.
So I think it's stirred enough. Good. Achievement unlocked. Last goodbye. And off I went, on nothing but a hunch. A call from a complete stranger. But I'd learned to trust my instincts, and there was something about this guy, his voice. I felt like I should know him. Either way, he sure seemed to know me. He did. This place does not look welcoming. Of course, that's where we're going. Of all the places to meet. The Neva Workers Resort. Right off the bat, I could feel there was something off about that place. Yeah. Get through the gate. Just my thought. Something off about this place. Anyone home? I guess not. Uh, yeah. Doesn't look like anybody's been at home for a while. What is this? Look. Oh, we just took it. Groundkeeper's postcard. Neva says hello. Ah, Neva says hello. You would love it here, my dear. Amazing day room for kids and free art lessons. Lots of families and the hotel, hotel is huge. I've never seen anything like it. Wish you would... Wish you... Wish you could be here with me. Miss you. F. Who's F? Maybe we'll find out. Hello? Thomas? Thomas? Or maybe we should see what he's up to. Oh, he's gone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's gone. How do we get through the gate? Just open it, maybe? The front gate was locked up tight. I needed to find another way in. Pull the planks from the window. Crawl through it. Can we do that? Is it even possible? Uh, no. Can we go around it, maybe? Oh, think we can. Look in the dumpster for a key. Oh no. We'll jump over the You want to keep wall. me out, Neva? <sighs> we're going to have to do better than that. So we're through the gate. Make your way deeper Not into the resort. Not a whole lot of people knew about Neva. It used to be a government-owned vacation resort. Until one day it just stopped. We can run. And so an urban legend was born. The Neva Massacre. The details were always fuzzy. Crazed workers, ancient curses. You know, the usual. So something definitely happened here. No fire without a smoke? Is that how you say it? Just 
random randomly. There's a small girl playing ball with us. Of course. Nothing strange about that at all. Press and hold control. Huh. Yeah. Hello. Where did the footsteps go? They gone? Okay, there they are. Oh, something on the tree. What's this? T plus C. Nineteen sixty eight. Who is T and C? I wonder. Oh, something on the tree over here. I wonder what that could be. I, how do we... What is that? Look at it. Maybe it's just a trail. Huh. Looks like an old fort. Might be my way in. read the sign. It says warning. Warning due to the recently unearthed remains. Renovation works have been suspended pending archaeological examination. Alright. What are those sounds that I heard? I heard sounds. Right, let's go. Something happened here. Yeah. I can tell. Go. If a place had a story to tell, well, I guess I was there to listen. Okay. This is pretty cool, actually. Are we supposed to go up here? I guess? Oh. Who's that? Dead. Like everything else in this place. Focus on the spirit world. Okay. Oh. We can switch folk. Wait a minute. Go back. We cannot switch focus here, but we can... In here. Am I supposed to do something? Where 
Where does this go? Yeah, not getting through here. Not with the power out. When you exist in two realities, you're affected by either. I'd learned that the hard way. What does that mean? When you exist in two places, you are affected by either? So I guess I... I guess I need to do something here. Just don't know what. I think I need to fix that. Okay, let's go back to the thing. How do we... How can we do something with it? Nope, it's not what I wanted to do. No, we can go this way. Oh, very nice. What is that? Someone new. Ah. Okay. Let's go the other way, maybe. The place felt old and soaked in misery. Figures, I guess. A thousand years of history doesn't just happen. It's paid for. But even in the deepest darkness, light can linger. Lonely. Fragile. Waiting for someone to embrace it. Okay. As I absorbed the energy, I wondered who it was that left it behind. A dying soldier whispering the name of his beloved? Or maybe just glad to be done with this war? Wait, wait am I supposed to... Hold it? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we can use this on the on the thing, on the breaker box. To like power it or break it so we can get through. I don't know. Let's try it out. Wait. Oh yeah. In any case. I figured I could use it. Energy's energy, right? Press and hold space to charge a spirit blast. Let go to unleash. Whoa, so that worked. Good for you, Marianne. These powers of mine, as much of a pain in the ass as they were, they did come in handy sometimes. They sure do. So there I was. Existing in two worlds, but never really living in either. Fire hazard. Oh. 
Where are the footsteps? Oh, they're right there. So we can go two ways. Two directions. Oh. Dead animal. Oh. What happened to you? Yeah. I wonder. Okay, we cannot go this way. Again, there are two ways. There are no footsteps this way. That I can see. No footsteps this way either. Ah! I've seen others like it, but never this intense. It was like a landfill of memories, emotions, and none of them good. So it's like the whole building is cursed or something. I don't know. We're going to have to see in the next episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.